I'm Wen Jin and I'm designing the Royal Mint Luna coin collection and this year is the year of the monkey. The year of the sheep was a calm and um, domestic year. I think it was about family and um, homemaking. As far as I know, monkeys are very uh, lively and clever, intelligent, a bit cheeky, a bit naughty. Um, so I think it might be faster paced, and more active, more energetic. I decided to choose a rhesus monkey, which is an old world monkey. What really attracted me to them was how they move. They're very sociable, they live in big family groups. They're just very playful, they're very super cute to look at. When you watch them jump, you notice how big their feet are. There's often many different sketches and ideas. So I go, I do a drawing on the block and then I carve into the block and then I print it and then when I've come out the other end of the journey, then I look back and go, oh, um, was that what I wanted? Maybe not, I'll start again. So lino is a little bit um, difficult to carve. So when you put the knife into the block, your knife has to be quite certain where it wants to go. I think it's really good for doing dynamic shapes and forms and quite graphic silhouettes. I often commit fully to my design while I'm carving. I don't try and modify it halfway through. The main monkey is um, leaping from one tree into the void. He's leaping forward and you can't see where. Very brave, you know, very courageous. So the tree and the grasses represent the fact that the monkey can live in many different habitats. So they can live in the forest and they can live in the grassland and they can live by the water. And then the other monkey is like his buddy, you know, so she's just jumping the other way. She's just playing. So I have a very old style name seal which is hidden in the design and it looks like a little mango on the tree it's like a little fruit i enjoy designing the, the coin i think it's i'm getting used to the idea of working in a circle conveying movement you know the the idea that it's going to be in three dimensions with the relief and with the flat areas and playing with the frosting and the shiny areas so that's a really fun project to do so i am enjoying it you have this kind of idea of um, a little bit of rhythm across the series and um, conveying movement. The foliage on the coin is frosted and the table is shiny and polished. So when it catches the light, it looks like the leaves are, are very bright and the background is dark. So it has a very similar graphic quality to the lino cut that I made. The next coin in the series is the year of the rooster and um, the rooster is in a hidden location in the UK.